10 completed projects in Africa that shocked the world. Many mega projects have taken the world by surprise in Africa. These are some of the most ambitious engineering projects the world has ever seen. Because of their scale and extravagance, these massive projects have astounded the world. A combination of engineering effort and architecture design, cost, as well as the difficulty of implementation. As a result, it's difficult to believe that these 10 mega projects were completed in Africa. Without further ado, here are the 10 massive mega projects completed in Africa that have stunned the world. Please share your thoughts on these projects in the comments section. Also, remember to like this video and, if you are new to this channel, subscribe to Africa Reloaded so that we can grow and produce more amazing videos for you. 10. Warzazate Solar Project Morocco The Warzazate Solar Power Station, also known as the NOR Power Station, is a solar power complex with an auxiliary diesel fuel system located in Morocco's Dran Tafalalit region about 10 kilometers from the town of Orzazate. The world's largest concentrated solar power plant is made up of four linked solar mega plants with a total capacity of 510 megawatts. The solar power plant covers 6,178 acres and created over 1,000 construction jobs as well as 60 permanent jobs during the operation and maintenance phase. The Noor Concentrated Solar Power Plant was built by Saudi and Spanish contractors and is expected to cost more than $2 billion when completed. 9. Gautrain, South Africa Gautrain is an 80-kilometer-long express commuter rail system in South Africa's Hauding province that connects Johannesburg, Pretoria, and Kempton Park. The project's construction aimed at optimizing an integrated innovative public transportation system that enables and promotes Hauding Province's long-term sustainable economic growth. With a broader vision of industrializing and modernizing the region, Gautrain maintains the highest security standards, comparable to those used by modern trains in Europe and the United States. With over 650 closed-circuit television cameras installed on trains and station precincts, passengers boarding the train are safe. Gautrain is one of the fastest trains on the continent, with a top speed of about 160 km per hour on the high-speed rail system. 8. Madupi Power Station, South Africa The Madupi Power Station project is a Greenfields coal-fired power plant in South Africa's Limpopo province. The Madupi Power Station incorporates supercritical technology, allowing its boilers and turbines to operate at higher temperatures than other coal plants. Most importantly, the technology used to run the plant increases efficiency, resulting in less use of natural resources. The $9 billion power station was built in stages and is currently Africa's largest power station, producing 4,764 megawatts through its six 794 megawatt turbines. 7. Al Borak Bullet Train, Morocco Al Borak is a 323-kilometer-long high-speed rail service that connects Casablanca, Morocco's capital, and Tangier City, the country's main port. The bullet train, the first of its kind in Africa, was inaugurated in 2018 by Morocco's King Mohammed VI. Following a decade of planning and construction by the Moroccan National Railway Company, the train has two classes with a variety of convenient features such as an air conditioning system, special luggage areas, plenty of legroom, electrical outlets, and individual seats equipped with headrests developed by the French company Alston. The railway line has reduced travel times between Casablanca and Tangier from 4 hours and 45 minutes to 2 hours and 10 minutes. Al Borak is Africa's fastest train, traveling at 320 km per hour. 6. Dangote Oil Refinery Nigeria is Africa's largest oil producer and, after Libya, has the continent's second largest oil reserve. However, due to a chronic shortage of refined petroleum products, filling stations are either empty or selling very low-grade fuel, stifling the country's economic growth. To address this issue, Nigeria is currently building one of the world's largest refineries. 
the massive and magnificent Dangote oil refinery is a game changer that will propel Africa's development and deepen West African regional integration. Construction on the project began in 2016 by India Engineers Limited, the project's main contractor. The project reached a major milestone in December 2020, when it installed the world's largest crude distillation column, a processing tube the length of a football field and weighing as much as 320 elephants. Dangote Oil Refinery, which cost $16 billion, has a capacity of processing 540,000 barrels of crude oil per day by the end of 2023, enough to meet Nigeria's local oil demand and serve external markets. 5. Tazara Railway A binational railway connecting the Southern Africa Regional Transport Network to the Tanzanian port of Dais Salaam. Tazara is one of Africa's most remarkable projects, providing both freight and passenger services between Tanzania and Zambia. The Tazara Railway is the longest railway line in East and Central Africa, and one of the longest in Africa. It is also the only railway line that connects East Africa to Southern Africa, and it was China's largest foreign infrastructure investment at the time. Over 50,000 Chinese contractors and 60,000 African contractors worked on site to build the Tazara Railway, which used over 330,000 tons of railway and 89 million cubic meters of earth and rock. Trains on the Tazara Railway travel at a speed of approximately 110 kilometers per hour on the 1,860-kilometer railway line, which includes 93 train stations, 320 bridges, 22 tunnels, and 2,225 box culverts. Tazara Railway is widely regarded as one of the most significant engineering feats since World War II. 4. Suez Canal, Egypt The Suez Canal is an artificial waterway that connects the Mediterranean Sea to the Indian Ocean via the Red Sea. It is one of the busiest shipping lanes in the world, and it connects the Mediterranean Sea to the Red Sea, making it vital to global trade. The canal provides a shortcut for ships traveling between Europe, Asia, and East Africa, reducing the journey distance from the Arabian Sea to the UK by approximately 8,900 kilometers. A French engineer working in Egypt at the time first proposed the idea for the construction of the Suez Canal in modern times. Construction of the canal began in the 1830s at the canal's northernmost point in Port Said, with 1.5 million people working on the project over a 10-year period. Despite opposition and lack of interest from some global powers and international financial institutions, a high mortality rate during the construction period, and a slew of technical, political, and financial issues. Egypt completed construction of the Suez Canal in 1869, surprising many people around the world. 3. The Great Man-Made River, Libya Libya made an incredible discovery of large quantities of potable fossil water underground in 1983 while conducting oil exploration in 1953. The Libyan government then begun construction of an extensive network of underground pipelines and aqueducts in Libya that transport high-quality freshwater from ancient underground aquifers deep in the Sahara Desert via the Great Man-Made River Authority. The $25 billion project included the world's largest reservoir with a diameter of 1 kilometer and a capacity of over 24 million cubic meters, a network of 250,000 pipelines totaling 4,000 kilometers, hydraulic pumping stations, manned control communication systems, reservoirs and other structures, corrosion control, power operational support, and maintenance provision. The Great Man-Made River dubbed the eighth wonder of the world, has a network of pipelines from the Sahara Desert that supply water to the coast of Libya, where the majority of Libyans live. 2. Grand Renaissance Dam, Ethiopia The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam is the largest dam currently under construction in Ethiopia, located about 15 kilometers east of the border with Sudan on the Blue Nile. 
When completed, the dam will be the largest hydroelectric power plant in Africa and one of the largest in the world, with a capacity of 6.5 gigatons. The massive gravity compacted concrete dam has a height of 170 meters, a length of 1,800 meters, and a reservoir capacity of 74 billion cubic meters. It has a total length of 246 kilometers and a maximum depth of 170 meters. It can also handle a flood of 19,370 cubic meters per second and facilitate irrigation of approximately 500,000 hectares of new agricultural land. Over 10 million cubic meters of concrete are expected to be used until the project is completed, enough to construct up to 100 modern skyscrapers. After the first and second Francis turbines were installed, the dam began semi-scale operations in 2021. The dam's primary purpose is to generate electricity in order to alleviate Ethiopia's acute energy shortage and to export electricity to neighboring East African countries. 1. Egypt's New Capital City Egypt is building a new administrative capital just 28 miles east of Cairo. The $58 billion project, which began in 2015, is intended to serve as a hub for government and the finance industry. Egypt hopes to entice some of its current 20 million residents to relocate to the new city, which has room for 6.5 million people. The smart city is 45 kilometers east of Cairo and has 21 residential districts and 25 commercial districts. The city has a recreation park twice the size of New York City's Central Park, solar energy farms covering 90 square kilometers, and several artificial lakes. A technology park, 40,000 hotel rooms, a theme park four times the size of Disneyland, 2,000 educational institutions, 1,250 mosques, 663 hospitals and clinics, and a new international airport are also key features. The project has already received a total investment of $20 billion. These are some of the amazing infrastructural projects in Africa that upon completion will marvel the world. If you know of any other projects that we have not yet mentioned, please let us know in the comment section. Also, remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.